Every time you yell at your kids, put a quarter in your no yelling sock and soon you'll have a weapon to- I'm down here on the Texas border along with 18 senators and we just saw some resorts, I mean a, a detention centers that are filled with young adults being held in holes in the ground filled with water, music blasting, no social distancing, and what appears to be white foam oozing everywhere. And they were given small cups like this to drink from. On the other side of the river, we have the U.S., I mean, uh, Mexico, and you can hear them heckling us. Ted Cruz Ted sucks. Cruz sucks. Uh, you know, sucks. this is a humanitarian crisis, and Joe Biden and his administration must put an end to it. And cut. Uh, hey, ladies, you got any room in the hot tub for Teddy? <laughs> and will Bunch realize Georgia's racist governor signed Georgia's racist legislation and celebrated it while he sat in front of a painting of a Georgia antebellum plantation where 100 Americans were once owned by other Americans. If the baseball players will not or cannot boycott, the consumers must. Fans must boycott the Jackie Robinson Day games and the All-Star Game telecast on Fox. And then we move to basketball, where the Atlanta Hawks' next home game, April 11th, must be moved or the players must boycott. And in September, the Atlanta Falcons' home football games. After sports, we boycott movies filmed in Georgia and consumer businesses based there, like Delta Airlines and Coca-Cola. The list of economic punishments for racism, which we can accomplish, is endless. We already went through this shit with Georgia in 1862 and in 1962 boycott georgia yeah. i got this feeling inside my bones you win the club just to party i'm there i get paid a fee it's friday night and i won't be long till i hit the guns fly hit the guns fly i'm living out in l.a i drop